Hey guys, my name is Sidiac and welcome back to another episode of Sib Casino, where boys, I think we can officially call this the make or break episode. We're even going to turn things around and make so much cash money moolah you won't believe. And we're going to go into some rapid expansions. Or ultimately, this could be the episode where we lose everything. Now, do not worry. Whatever way it turns out, whether we make money, great. We'll continue the series. We'll keep building up on the casino before we're ready to sell it and then build a new one with everything I've learned so far. Or we lose everything and I can't afford to pay the bills. We sell the casino and I build a new one with everything I learned so far. So either way, it's going to turn out to be a okay because I've learned so much. And today I want to implement a little technique that a lot of you guys who are really good at this game have told me. And a little bit of a tip uh, many, many people have been saying, Yo, Cineac, the real money is in slot machines. And it kind of makes sense. Because when I go back to, like, the previous day, and I go to... Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Why can't I see it? Gambling. Wait, day eight? I made no money in gambling? Are you for real? That's crazy. But when you take a look at it, income, slot machine, holy moly, we made so much cash. Which made Sediac go a little, I'm gonna try and go a little bit crazy, but the downside is a slot machine costs like two and a half grand. I've only got nine grand. So it does mean I'm gonna pull out a bank loan, which why it is ultimately going to be make or break. Now, if you do enjoy this, guys, and want to see more from Sim Casino, then please make sure you smash that like button down below. If you aren't already, then make sure you do subscribe so you are notified when those next episodes do come out. Now, we need to get a bank loan then to get things rocking and rolling. So I could build more hotel rooms, but cost money. And the reason I'm going down the slot machine route first is because we are building a casino. We need to have gambling things. So, bank loans, uh, I think we can take up to a maximum of 50 grand. Is that right? It's a long-term 28-day loan. So, if I... Up oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No, you can take more than that. Right, if I take 100k, right, which terrifies me, I'm going to apply for the loan. And here is the loan right now, which means it expires in 12 hours. The length of it is 28 days. Interest rate is 3.6%. Whew, damn. Um, which means with... Wait, what? Total interest? Oh my good God. And if I decline it, you can't change the rate. No. Apply. Decline. It's all the same. Is 4.8%? Wait, is the APR just going up and up every time I decline it? Oh, either way, I'm going to have to take it anyway, so I'm going to accept it. Got 100 grand in the bank. We're going to pause right now because I'm going to revolutionize and completely change um, this whole casino layout. Now, the first thing I want to do is actually move the pit boss room, right? That's what I kind of want to do first. So if I drag it from over here and do a 5x5 five five room, we quickly, because I want more space in, in the, the foyer area, <laughs> as we're going to call it, to build what we need to build. So staff facilities, the pit boss room, drag that there, pull a door there, and then ultimately drag and move. Uh, the computer desk is what they require. Then I'm going to first then remove some stuff there. I need to re demolish this. No, not this, the structure, sorry. The D zone as well. And then I need to get rid or demolish the walls. Which is the one that demolishes the walls again? This one. Bam. And bam. Thus giving me more room around here to build. So I'm just making sure the pit bus goes to their new room. Which is what they're doing right now. They're heading over there. And again, so once they've skid out of that way, I pause again. Because I need to make this beautiful. So we're going to reconfigure the actual uh, slot machines right now. Now, these ones are our £10 plays. There are 25 cent ones. These are 5 cent ones. So let's start with the 5 cent ones. And I'm going to do it like this. We're going to drop it there. No, actually, no. Let me move, flip it around on this side instead. So there. Move you there. 
So making sure that these are all our five cents. We're going to do them in like order. Like we'll have a row of five cent ones, then a row of ten, and then so on and so on. Uh, do we have any ten cent ones? Oh, actually, do you know what? I don't think we do. So we've got the five cent ones there, which we'll have in a complete row. Then facing them, we'll have then our twenty five cent ones. Right, I'm creating a more efficient system for our slot machines. Right, there are uh, 25 cent ones yet. And then I've got the 10 pound ones left. I got the, tw oh no, more 25 cent ones, sorry. Oh, so that's 25 cent as well. So let's move these back in onto them. So I've got a little bit of a walkway around the side of it, uh, of the slot machines, so we can, people can walk around and get to where they need to get to. So we'll do all of these here. 25 cents. I'm going to buy more, don't worry. I'm going to fill it all the way up to the end. So I'm just kind of getting my structure out. So then the one pound ones will then be facing uh, here. We're then going to get the walkway coming out, don't we? So if they were facing there, it means it would be backed onto it. And that means that one would then be here, which wouldn't work like that. So then maybe I give it a little bit of space. Right, and then we do a, a different system. So if I went with, let's see, that there, and then move this one to here. Yes, okay, I got it, I got it. Right, in my head, I have a design. You will see it very soon, how it's going to work. So move you to over here. So we've got slot, sh slot sh uh, machines for days right there. So, okay, before I move them ones then, let me get these all finalized then. So these are uh, gambling, these standard ones here. So one, two, three, four, five. There was quite a few. And then these ones over here, they're, they're a slightly bit different in terms of the games, but they're ultimately the same machine. So just like that, I've spent 20 grand. Whew. Damn. And on this side, we have the big flashy ones, this one. Bam, bam, bam. And then these ones are these like retro looking ones. So like that. Oh my goodness me, Sonic. We have got so, so many slot machines in right now. So many in. So cancel that for a minute. Then I'll get these ones and move these to be back down to here. Like this. I might still change the design. I'm, this might not stay. So if I had that there, because I do need walkways, don't I? Yeah, do you know what? We're gonna okay, we're gonna change the design one more time. And uh, I'll start with these again. So because I, I want that walkway to come in and go down and like that way, and then we build the do you know what I should have actually done? The flooring first. So right, 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 right. Okay, we'll go with a we'll go with carpets and we'll we'll kind of keep it like not too basic of a carpet. But, like, to indicate which is walkway and which is gameplay area. That makes sense. So, let's say I went with this checkered carpet here. And that is four across. And apparently I can't bring it across to here. Oh, can you do so much in one go, maybe? Hmm, I don't know. So there. We've got a free wide that sticks out to here. And that is, what's the whole distance there? Eight. So if I did a... A two gap, which gives you one, two, three, either side. Hmm. No, it doesn't really work like that, does it? It doesn't. So what if I just went for the free gap there to here to here? And then this came as a free gap coming up. And that became my walkthrough right now. So let me just sort out the carpets again how would that feel here for like the bar area yeah we'll go with that for there i don't know, actually i'm not very really good with doing designs like casino -y designs and whatnot so it is what it is uh, i feel like i want to get this going all the way around like that and then the same thing here for the casino I should have backed up to there, all the way to there. 
And then I'm going to... I'm going, I'm going, I'm going to get down. Is this funky enough for a casino, guys? Is it funky enough? Or is, is it at this point way too funky? I'm doing these little borders now. I think that is too jazzy. It's too jazzy for my eyes. <laughs> Just throw that out there right now. What about that carpet? Because I've got... How much is this costing me, by the way? It's costing me a fortune. Because I like the idea of that carpet tearing through. And it kind of differentiates the, the rooms and areas. Yeah. And I think then... Where's that blue bluish carpet here? Then be a border to the room around here. I've got to learn casino designs. I am well aware of this. I'm well aware that I need to learn casino designs, but how about those apples? Yeah? Right, we'll go with this. We'll go with this. It looks terrible. <laughs> it really does. <laughs> right. Anyway. So I'm going to move the slot machines now. So if I had these, then... Oh, actually, do you know what? I've actually lost room, haven't I, by doing that. But if I... Right, how did I do it up to there? I left the space, didn't I? Right, if I drop you there and just completely move all these over to this side, I shouldn't have done the floor. I regret doing the floor now. I Honestly, I do. It looks a shambles. I regret everything. I ultimately regret everything. <laughs> I'm never going to be happy in this game. I bet you right now I'll never be happy building these casinos. Right, you to there. It's because I need to, like, start... Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to save the flooring for when I start all over again. Because then I can design... Because I'm just literally dropping stuff wherever for the sake of it. Oh, wait, what is that? Oh, that looked a lot bluer there. Hmm. Right, back to carpets. Should we just keep it simple? How simple, simple, brown. <laughs> Sadiac. Is that too much? How much is that going to cost me to fill up to there? Two grand. Right, I'm going with it, guys. I'll leave that little room where the gambling's happening. Okay. I'll save the carpet patterns until um, I build a brand new casino. So let me move these to over here then. So these are our uh, 10 pound games. Whew. Damn. Someone's got the money right now. Now I do know a lot of the new stuff I've just placed down, I have to change the pricing of them. So we'll get into that in just a moment. And then we'll end this row just here. Again, a lot of slot machines now being placed down. So should we just kind of go with that for now? I think we'll just go with that for now. I know I'm going to need more ATM machines because people are going to be redrawing money like crazy. So if I drop one there, uh, ATM machine, they only cost a thousand a piece. One there and one there. Get one in the corner over here, one in the corner over here. It's a lot of ATM machines now being placed down. Uh, these benches, I'm just going to move them in the central section just here. And we'll drop now a few more down. Where do we get the benches from again? Here. Benches. What are, are they these ones? Yes, they are these ones. There we go. Benches for days. So that's a lot of uh, slot machines right now, isn't it? It is. So this is 25 cents. So apply all in the same game. No, play, apply all in a row. These are 25. Okay, play all, apply all in a row. These ones behind are 25. We'll make them pound. Apply all in a row. These are oh, these should be the 20 the 10 pound games. Apply all in a row. These are the 10 pound games. Apply all in a row. These should be the 10 pound games. Apply all in a row. These are the penny. Well, they're not they shouldn't be penny, but they're they're a pound. Apply on a row to make sure it's the same. A pound, apply on a row. Oh, wait, do we have any five pound ones? No, these can be the five pound ones. 
apply all in a row so then all of them should be five pound sweet i think we're good to go I've, we've got so many more slot machines now in and i'm left with 19 grand so i've got to leave a little bit of money left over it's going to take a while right now for like we need deliveries and stuff like that all in but the amount of people that can now come in and then use the slot machines again that's apparently where we make the serious money so if this doesn't turn out to be exactly the a game i don't know what will the workers going around right now filling up the slot machines with that cash and as the day progresses and we get busier and busier now the slot machines don't require any additional workers so i'm just hoping that we can make more money out of them i mean there's lots of people coming in they're all choosing to go onto these ones which are 25p slots uh, these are the pound ones got a couple over here on the pound ones as well but we just gotta wait for the big ballers to come in <laughs> then we'll make the money boys then we'll make the money um right okay so they won't fill these ones because i need to wait for another delivery and stuff like that um how is the money today we are oh yeah okay we're in profit because technically we got that loan <laughs> we did get that loan uh gambling so slot machine income is three grand at the minute this is not showing gambling as any profits either how do i minimize it day seven gambling nothing do we have no net or have i got to empty all the machines does the machine get emptied itself when it gets filled up i'm not 100 percent. or do we make our money from the um the atm withdrawals so if i emptied the cash here now the pit boss will come in and do it do i get that money man those 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 slot machines are kind of slowly creeping up right they slowly are where's our cash vault how much cash we got in here boy or we gotta wait for the delivery i forget how to play this game at times <laughs> uh, i do forget but the upside is we're closing in on um having twenty thousand in the bank so does that mean the money is slowly coming in we're up to 10.7k in today's money so we're going in the right direction somehow just gotta wait for the taxes to be paid <laughs> there's a lot of people now just chilling like strawberry villains Is that because more people can buy drinks and just sit down and relax could be could be now not to say that I feel, I'm, I'm sensing a slight change in the casino but i don't feel like we're losing that much money Right, when's our next delivery coming it is coming in 15 hours the supply truck now we have way 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 more um machines for slots so do i need to up this i think one crate might be enough still i still gotta learn the balancing of, of all that kind of stuff as well right we could do with more hotel rooms I got some money to be able to build an additional one but i want to see what happens okay 11 okay the money is definitely going up because we had like nine profit I mean, you got to take into account the loan we had nine profit and now we're up to 11. so if i was losing money that nine would have went down to like eight or seven have we found the little balance maybe 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 right let's build some additional hotel rooms then uh, and we'll try and get them on this side as well to utilize this little extra bit of space that i've got so foundations we know that that is 12 across so if i left a one two hold on there is one two three so that would be 12 then will be nine and that's as far back i'm going to take that which the whole of that then is four nearly five grand 
This is to flip then the hotel rooms on the opposite side. Um, okay, so I'm going to spend money like it's no man's business right now. And this is all going to punch us in the right direction. So dismantle walls and fences. Goodbye. Goodbye. And then build walls and fences. So we've got a two wide gap going across. And it's each hotel room is the length of seven. Oh, wait, by 13? Has... Have I miscalculated? Was that not... Oh, that's four across. Okay, can, do I get a refund for uh, demolishing foundations? Do I? Probably not. <laughs> but the wall tool right now. 12 down. Four. Is it four? That's another thing right now. One, two, three, four. No, it's five. Now, once I build this one mirrored, then it's all good. It's all good at that point. So, hotel, bedroom, private bathroom, uh, private locked door. No. Let me, I won't put the door there just yet until I've actually finished building the room. Now, I've got to literally mirror this whole room, which is... A bit more confusing now. I flipped it. Um, right, bath would go. Wait, no, that would go there. I've already messed it up with the door. Good job. We can move it. There we go. Then the toilet, which doesn't want to rotate. Have I got to spin round instead? Yeah, the toilet, which is actually there. The shower then goes there. The sink then goes there. That's the, the toilet, the bathroom done. TV on the wall. Little computer desk in the corner. Oh, and the wardrobe. Can't forget the wardrobe. Uh, this way is, isn't it? Yeah. That goes there. That room is then done. All I gotta do is put in then the the locked door. And then somebody, when they're ready, can then use that room. Which is good. It is good, good, good stuff. Okay. So the day hasn't now started all over again. The housekeeping is now entered. Somebody's already taken... Oh, I didn't put it to 300 big ones. I've just got an $80. Forgot about that, guys. Forgot about that. That's all good. That's all good. Um, right. So at least now moving forward, we're all good. Down to 3400 in cash. We lost 7000 a day so far, all down to uh, construction. And a little bit of staff wages. So now... Let's, try, let's check the previous day. 1,200, again, taxes went out. I bought more stuff. I built all them foundations, so lots of money went out. Uh, gambling. Uncollected prizes. Income came from the vault collection and the reimbursal. So how do we actually make money from gambling, then? Accommodation, business, construction. There's the income. There's the outgoing. So where's the net? Or do we just have to collect them bad boys? It's a weird one, isn't it? I don't think I fully understand the game. But we need more computer desks anyway, because the amount of people that keep coming in to use that one computer is a bit mad. Um, let's work out when them transportation's coming in. In two hours, the supply truck. And then in 13 hours, the armored truck's coming. Ah, hold on. Fills your vaults of cash or empties them uh, into your bank when it has reached a target. Ah. Gotcha. So, I, if, I mean, how do I... Is it possible to, like, empt, like everything to get emptied? Um. 
Oh wait, hold on, you get different brand commissions? You get different levels of attraction and commissions. Ah, I didn't even realize that to be honest with you. Did not even realize that right now. Right, how's the money doing? We've lost a big chunk of change from restocking. But that's okay. Because we needed those goods, and now we should slowly make that money back. Is that a worker there? Yeah. Nobody wants to restock these, do they? I think I might have needed to add, it, uh, add in an additional... I'll put it to free. I think that's what I needed to do, wasn't it? My bad. My bad, guys. But look, can we turn the tides now? Mine is 6,000. And that includes a 5,700 uh, construction cost as well. Hmm. Right, okay. Okay, okay, okay. So, one thing I didn't add to the hotel was the windows. I don't think you can put windows in this game, right? Is there such thing as having windows? Um, construction. Yes, there is, Seniac. Yes, there is. Uh, a nice higher capacity... Oh, that's a door, sorry. Um... Commercial double door. Oh, they're doors. Oh, windows are here. Okay, so deck driver jet also provides uh, a view for a hotel. What do I go for? The big wide one or this? No, we'll go for this one. Right, we're going to build some windows right now, guys. Because they require having window access. Make those rooms a bit nicer. Does it change? <gasps> it changes the satisfaction of the price, which means I can make it even higher. Hold on. So if I up this to 340, so I get an extra $40 out of each room. Just by adding a window in. That's crazy. That is legit crazy, isn't it? I should have done that in the first place. But there we go. Windows. No windows in here, though. I don't want them to know it's daytime outside and they need to go home. I know that's a little game plan what casinos do in real life, isn't it? I know I know that's a thing. I know. I, I legit know that's a thing right now. Right, anyway. Uh, okay, we're 6.30 in the evening. And if I didn't take my construction into cost, then I would technically be in profit right now. So you could say, I imagine, it's not a lot of profit. And when the taxes are paid, I'm going to lose money. But I'm running out of profit until we do pay taxes. Which I don't understand how we can pay taxes because didn't make profit. You know what I mean? You pay profit, corporation, tax on profit. Excuse me. We've got no profit right now. What are you trying to say? I have no idea. No idea right now. Uh, right. Right, 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 right. How can we... Well, I say how can we make more money? We need the gambling machines to all be fun fully functional. So I'm hoping those additional crates would see us through. I could build an additional hotel room. Because i got room over here, but I don't know if I've got the funds to be able to do it. Um, how much have we made from accommodation so far? 4,300. So we're still ticking along with that. We haven't added any, any additional staff, so the wages all stay the same. Yeah, the wages all stay the same. So, And what day? It's Wednesday. It gets more busier on the weekend, doesn't it? Yeah. Right, okay, sweet. So, if we got to the point where we was able to then start researching something, 
Um, I can't afford to do it. The only thing I can do right now is bigger loans. <laughs> do I want to take another loan? It'd be one way to make sure that we do make more money. But bank loans. My credit score is currently bad. Because of how much we've taken. Um, probably because I kept de declining loans as well. But I can pay this loan in full. Outstanding. Oh wait, outstanding? That's not 200,000. Should I take the maximum loan of quarter of a million? The way it said it down here, like total interest. Oh yeah, it does contain interest. What am I talking about? I'm going to accept that loan. Quarter of a million. Oh, Sally, I quite, I'm, I'm nervous now. This is this is a little bit too much. This is a little bit too much. Right. Right, okay, 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 okay. okay. So you're getting a bit too crazy right now. You're getting a bit too crazy with all of this. Let's first research some stuff. Reduced the card payments. About half of your customers use cards to make purchases. Reduce the card fee from 30 cents to 50 cents. Reduce the frustration ATMs. My customers are charged one dollar instead of three dollars. Sweet. Let's get that research. Then, what's the rule? Table game rule editing allows you to customize table rules alone for high casino advantages. <gasps> okay, that's good. Get that going. That's why my tables aren't making as much money. Sweet. We got instant delivery trucks. That will help us out. All right. Larger loans, I'll grab that as well. It's all queued, this stuff. Faster internet, reduces guests from using your... Um, reduces frustration. I don't feel like we got that much frustration. I think the frustration at the moment is no one can do anything about it. Higher limit gambling zone. Allows you to play at high cost. Yeah, she is inside. Ooh. Okay, we'll do that as well. Higher gambling limit, and then that's it no more first things first i want to get more um, computers in over here on the business side of things which business use over here computer desk and we'll go bam 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 and then we'll get multiple printers in i guess people want to use it that enables then more people to use our little computer room. Good stuff. Now, foundations. How far can I extend this way? To there is my limit. Okay. Reason for it is because this is a little room now for the tables. If I can do all that kind of good stuff, I'm going to get it set up first. So, walls and dismantling. Get rid of them. And... We'll come back to that moment. I can actually extend this as well. We'll come back to that momentarily. I'm going to go seven. Oh, no, that's demolishing, isn't it? Yeah. Right, hold on. Um, wall tool. Seven across, straight down. And then build one more hotel room. And I think that'll be enough hotel rooms for now, wouldn't it, after this one? Because I'm, I'm pushing the boat out of how much money I can make off them, potentially. I can add more stuff to them, though. And that will also make me more money. So, let's just go for this one by one. Uh, bam. Shower, bam. Toilet, bam. Sink, bam. Uh, door, bam. Privately locked door, bam. And then... The bed... can't see what's going on here let me turn this around there we go bam bam the tv oh there's so much to throw in all of this is it possible to quick place everything like you can copy a whole entire room because that will make life so much easier wouldn't it that would right hotel room bedroom private bathroom and we make this. Well, I make it 340, but I got a place down. Can't forget it. A freaking window. There we go. 
Nice. So when the walls are up, the windows are there. Good stuff. Very good stuff. So additional hotel room then. Got these expansions ready to go. I've also got 176,000 currently in the bank ready for me to progress a little bit further. What we could think about adding in is then the buffet. And hopefully that makes us the serious cash. But uh, right, anyway, what is going to get researched next then? What are we waiting for? So currently underway is reducing the card payments. Oh, good. Oh, good, oh, good, oh, good. Shall we sort this room out then while we're waiting? I'm going to redo the flooring. Um, themed floors. Oh. Can I rotate these? How do you do a themed floor to go in a certain pattern? Yeah, that's not how I want it. I mean... If I did that there... Okay, it's like a zigzag pattern, isn't it? I mean, it's pretty cool, though. Tiles. Now, I'm going to stick to carpets. And we'll stick to that pattern that we've got right now, anyway. Where is it? It's this one here. But I'm going to change the colour going around the outside. Maybe I'll make it go like a lighter colour. Instead of blue. We'll go with that instead. Yeah. Sweet. Then we'll have, we'll have, we'll have, we'll have, we'll have, we'll have the blackjack table. What have I done? What have I done? Oh no, I'm moving it. It's, oh, it's the designer tool. Blackjack table. There. I'm going to build a few more in because I know we're going to get an unlock. Oh, then again, we can do all the different other styles of gambling, couldn't we? So that was the blackjack. That's the, the baccarat table we'll put the roulette table there that's the poker table which I'll place in here the craps table free card poker table Place that there. Yeah, we don't have a craps table, which... Oh, it's a bit bigger than I thought it was going to be. The pow go ta poker table? Never heard of that. Don't know what that is. Anyway, okay, so I can't get any more in. Then again, I could if I rotated them. So we've got you there. Moved you. If I put that one there... Hold on, because I, I got some ideas. That there. That there. You just there. There we go. See, reposition them has now enabled me to put in this craps table. Okay. Which I don't have to hire workers, do I? They just they just turn up on themselves. So 151,000 is what we now got in the bank. Lots of people working in the computer room. Oh, good. Right, we got this going. We officially got this going right now. Um, right. Researchers. Any of them done? Yes. They, they reduce the card fees, so that improves the satisfaction. And it technically puts an extra £1.50 into the customer's pocket because they don't get charged. Meaning we could potentially make an extra £1.50. Doesn't seem like a lot, but, you know, I'll take it. I'll freaking take it. So next, we're currently researching then the... We did the bigger advantage, didn't we? Lobby for double house advantages and machines, tables. Yeah. Uh, the, the table game rule editing. We can edit all of the rules on these tables, which would be quite exciting. So we're still waiting for another delivery of the cards. So we should actually 
inventory settings, card decks, get two of those. Which we should also then be able to do instant delivery once we've also researched, like I said, instant delivery. <laughs> which should give us also another bigger advantage. Right, the loans are doing... Oh my goodness, look how many people are on these slot machines right now. These are the, uh, the 25 cent ones. Oh, we've actually also got um, the stock for that too. So do I need more 25 cent machines? No, nah, we've still got a few gaps. We're okay there. Oh, this is crazy. I feel like we're now, we've injected steroids into our casino. We really have. Next episode then, we 100% need to get the buffet service up and running. 100%. I'll kind of build it around these. So we, we try and do like a little UE in the corridor system. And I build it inside of the UE. Our little buffet service. Then providing food and hopefully making even more money. This is too exciting. So we're 1.7 hours away from completing the table game um, rule editing. Which is good for us. On the day so far, we've made 149... No, yeah, don't get too excited. I did get a bank loan. <laughs> I did get a bank loan. But in terms of gambling, 5,000 already on slot machines. That's good to see. Got the craps tables on the go. Killing it, mate. Killing it. Well, I say that, I don't really know the full outcome. <laughs> right, why is this 20 Gs in the bank right now? Currently cash in the vault. Alright, we've got 20 Gs in the vault. Which, once the armoured truck comes, does that put them put that 20 grand into our bank account? I think that's what it does, right? Is this person over here okay? Yeah, okay, they're just... Okay, yeah, no, they're, oh, yeah, they're going to gamble. <laughs> right, did we get that research and done? Yes, I can now edit the, the gable, uh, the gable, the table game rules, which will blackjack, manage game. Oh my goodness me! How can you rig a game of blackjack? Oh, I don't feel good about this. Right. So blackjack edge. I don't know what any of these means. Casino commission. Don't know what that means. Um, payout, three over two, outcome chance. The outcome chance on this edge is quite high. Right, one. Okay, maybe, okay, I don't edit blackjack. It seems a bit crazy. Roulette table. I don't feel like I know what I'm doing, to be honest with you. That's what I feel. I feel like it's actually quite overwhelming, isn't it? So day 11. Total receipt payouts one. Chips one. Is that how much like we've made? Because that's quite a lot of money, if that's the case. Uh, craps. I mean, I, I know I can edit all of this, but I don't know what I'm doing. If anyone knows like what I should be doing with this... Let me know in the comment section down below. It's cool that I get to edit it, but you know what I mean? Oh, instant delivery trucks are happening next. Okay, that's a big one for us. That really is. All right, and this next day is... How much have we made off our accommodation, sorry? That's what I want to look at then. 6,000 already. Whew. Damn. I, mean, I could add some more stuff into the rooms and then charge a little bit more money. This is beautiful. So, oh my god, look how many people we've had in today. 381 people are coming to the casino. That's ridiculous. Are these are ATM machines still have enough cash in them that people can withdraw? <laughs> yeah, we're all good. Right, it's the time of day where everyone goes home. Apart from the new people working at these tables. So we've still got a little bit of gambling going on. Dude over here right now, making a killing off these drinks. Making loads of money for us right now. 
this is good right and then instant delivery is done yet yes instant delivery now done which they're now working on next uh da, 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 da. larger loans there we go sweet so deliveries i can call in early for two grand that's good so when we had that big problem with all the little exclamation marks above all the machines i can call it in straight away and get the money now it does cost me two grand extra but if i can afford to do it then that's good I can solve many, many issues. Is that trash on the floor? Oh, no. Okay, hold on. So, what am I now missing in terms of that paint? Oh, we can paint the walls? Oh, that makes that makes me realize how terrible our casino is. So, comfort and facilities. That's decorations. Wait, hold on. Uh, oh, these are oh, trash cans what we need to place down. We've got a couple of trash cans down, but not everyone seems to want to use them. All right, place one there. Place one up here. Place one down there. We have a trash can right there. Use it. Um, we've got a snack vending machines, and we're okay for those. We've got a couple of seats down there. We're okay for those. Decorations. Ooh, we can make this place pretty nice, couldn't we? Decorative light to make people happier. Oh, damn. Okay, that's kind of crazy. Oh, you could do so much good stuff with all of this. Entertainment uh, stuff. So... We still got to unlock all the theater hall and the bingo hall and all that kind of jazzy stuff. That's crazy. Uh, staff facilities. In the garbage zone. Yeah, should we drop in a dumpster? Just to kind of help them out there. Um... Trash bins, storage, don't need any of that just yet. No, we're good with all that kind of stuff. Right, anyway, I'm getting carried away all over again. So, on the day so far... Wow! Today so far... Cash collection. Because the money got added to the bank, we're up seven grand on the day. Yeah, because that ten grand came out of that twenty grand. That's a point. Transportation uh, section, the armored truck. The armored truck came. Can it only take 10 grand at a time? Advanced security. Hmm. Sports book. What's this? Let your guests place bets, relax, and watch sport. Oh, snap. That's amazing. That really is. Right, housekeeping, workman, pit bus, admin, uh, skewing crime, maintenance. I'm just trying to see if anything you can do like getting a clean out or does housekeeping do that? How does that work or do workers go around cleaning? I'm not 100%. But I feel like we've made a big step forward. I told you this was going to be the make or break episode. I feel like with the addition of loans, obviously... We have slightly made it. There's still a lot of configuration we still need to get up and, and running. But as of right now, hold on. Where do I see it? Casino valuation. Now, I do have a lot of debts. I got that. You know, I get it. Uh, I could pay off this the this one in full. I can't pay off the current one. But once I get rid of those um, liabilities, then we'll have quite a nice little valuation on the whole casino, which we can then sell and start our brand new one. So I think that's what we're kind of working towards right now. Trying to make enough money to pay off the loans. And then in return, we can slowly start a new casino. But next episode, we're going to get the, the food all up and running. That tasty delicious uh, buffet uh, food right now that is exactly what we want and i think on that note guys we are going to end it for for here hope you enjoyed this episode if you did smash a like put it down below and until next time i'll see you all soon so good bye <laughs>